are you all today? Hope you're all alright. Uh, so yeah, after my five and a half pound gain last Thursday, I'm not going to go into it again. If you want to hear about it or my results, then go check out my video from last Thursday. It'll all be on there. So yeah, I um, I have been 100% on plan since Thursday. I haven't gone off plan. I haven't um binged even though I wanted to just sit down and binge and cry and eat my emotions and things like that as we do but I haven't so woohoo uh yeah I'm feeling a bit more umphed today if you know what I mean a bit more positive even though I'm still really bloated and fed up I'm still a little more positive yeah I think that's the word we're going to go for today so yeah so i'm not going to rant on any more about my drama <laughs> because we all know the bed drama's been and gone so move on vicky move on so i am going to be sticking to plan still from now until thursday well and continuing but you know what i mean um and yeah so i just thought i'd do a what are you in a day video today one for me to just stay on track and be honest with you guys and two just because I don't want you thinking I've fallen off the face of the earth because I haven't I just I just want to hide in my bed but I'm still here so I just thought I'd come on show my face and plus I miss you guys so I've had to come back and say hello miss your comments and things like that so yeah and thank you for all your kind comments and messages um from my weighing results um every single comment I got meant the world to me so thank you very 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 much from the bottom of my heart i really appreciate it you're all amazing so thank you yeah without further ado let's stop rambling and i'm just going to get on with it and just do a simple what i ate in a day monday so yeah i will show you my breakfast so this is breakfast it doesn't look the best in the jar but it's just the way i like to eat it it is overnight oats um 40 grams using for my b choice allowance uh, mixed in with some Muller Light yogurt, um, it's the banana and custard one. Mixed in with that is a load of blueberries. You can kind of see some of them poking through, but there's loads of blueberries in there. And then just on the top there is some raspberries. So yeah, that's my breakfast this morning. Just something quick and easy that I knew would be there to grab out the fridge. So I've got no excuses to grab something that's not slim and well friendly so that I can just literally grab it and go and eat it without having to think and make a drama out of it and stress myself out just make things easier on yourself guys if you're struggling overnight oats is brilliant because you just literally bung it all together the night before pop it in the fridge take it out when you want it and job is a good day so yeah that's my breakfast this morning and i've had two cups of no i've had one actually i've had one cup of tea i'm um, using my a choice allowance um and i'm on my first h2o on the go so yeah, that's breakfast and I will see you at dinner time. <coughs> I forgot to mention earlier that I am feeling a bit under the weather. Um, I've got, it's not a cold, but it's not, not a cold. I can't describe it. I've got a really sore throat and it feels like my chest is really heavy. I feel a bit nasally, but not completely nasally. And I just feel rubbish and I keep getting terrible migraines. And my bones are all achy and I'm just I just feel heavy and I'm just <sighs> feeling a bit sorry for myself. And so I've been feeling like this now since Thursday. So I do feel a bit under the weather. If it's gone really dark, I apologise. It's because it's just started peeing down with rain now. All the snow's gone. It's all nice and clear, you know, I had to try and drag myself through mush, getting more ill and that the other day with Craig. Uh and no, it's just peeing down with rain. I feel sorry for Craig because he's been out in all weathers through that snow and everything else that was been going on. He uh, he had to work through it all. They don't let you take time off or anything like that. Oh, God forbid, no. Uh, and now he's getting drenched and he's not very well either. we both got this nasty cold thing. He can't stop coughing. Trying to stay away from cough sweets and cough medicine. I have found these cough sweets, the little tiny ones from Home Bargains. Um, if, if I've if I remember, I'll put a photo on, just so you can see. But uh, they're only six calories each. I've had two <laughs> uh, in the past couple of days, just because I really don't want to use sins or anything on them, but they're not bad for six calories each. So, 
yeah. And I've just been, me and Craig have just been having these. Hopefully these aren't sinned. If they are, I'm not sinning them. But they're just chewable vitamin C. And as you know, I don't eat fish or anything like that. So I've been having some cod liver oil tablets just to get some goodness in there. I forgot to show you earlier. I tried these yesterday for the first time. Butter mint twinings tea. They are sin free. Really nice. Really recommend them. If you like them butter mint sweets that you can get um, from Tesco's, which are a sin each, by the way. Yum yum. Um, you will love these. But if you don't want it too pepperminty tasting, don't leave the tea bag in too long. If you want it butter minty, what I do is I boil the kettle, put my tea bag in, and my uh, sin free sweeteners. <clears throat> I put about two in because it's nice and sweet, then, isn't it? But it's up to you how many you want. And, uh, I literally pour the hot water over the tea bag go put some cold water in as well because i'm too impatient to wait for it to cool down by the time i get back i literally dunk squish the tea bag about take it out and then it's butter minty not just minty so be careful but yeah they're really nice they're from tesco's um i can't remember how much they were they were on offer though so yeah so i've just got a simple quick dinner nothing too exciting but i have made the um couscous cake that's been doing its round since um, Jane Bradders did a video on it on her live YouTube. Um, but it was originally from somebody called Charlotte on Instagram. I'm not sure who it is. Um, I don't know. So, um, yeah, I kind of just winged my own in in invention of how I want it to taste and what I'd like. The little silver balls on the top, they work out to, um, for 30 grams, it all, they work out to like three sins. But you get loads. <laughs> Um, so I just didn't even put half a sin's worth on and yeah you get loads so technically this is about half a sin but it's not even that to be honest but Craig's obviously going to try some of this as well I have got two little finger slices um, so with my dinner so enough, of, enough waffling um, I'm going to show you what I've got so I can go and sit in my bed yes in my bed eat this get warm um, <clears throat> and watch a Disney with my chihuahua <laughs> so Rant over, show you my dindins. <laughs> oh, button thing off, I'll show you my dindins. So this is dinner guys. <clears throat> it's the Asda Singapore snack pot. These are two sins each. So yeah, they're, they're really quite nice. They're not as nice as the original proper ones, the naked noodles, but these are really nice and so much cheaper. I think they're like 89p, 69p, something like that. I do do a couple of other flavours, but I can't remember what they're called. So yeah, that will be two sins. Um, I've got two apples for speed, and two think literally they are finger slices. <laughs> Look, there's my finger. Can you? That's my little finger as well. <laughs> so I did only have two little slivers of it. This is a tweak, the couscous cake, guys. It is sin free, but it is still known as a tweak. So don't have it all the time. If you do, um, you know, just put, be prepared for what you know your weight loss results may be. I, I'm not sure, so just be careful, guys. Okay, because it is known as a tweak, and I don't want to upset anybody or you know, yeah. So just be careful. But it is all sin free, so just have it accordingly. Don't have it all the time. It is very nice. Mine's all cinnamony and mixed spice flavourings and things like that. And then I've just got my second H2O on the go. So yeah, this is dinner, guys. See you at tea time. Quick, these are the cough sweets I was on about. Did it rip it off? Yeah, ripped it off. They were six calories per sweet. If you want to just look at the, oh, at the back. Yeah. So, yeah, I've only had two for the past like four or five days, but I might have one in a bit after I've eaten if my throat's still burning. So, I'm going to go chill out with my Disney movie now.
Hello everyone, so this is what I've got for tea tonight. This is Craig's, he basically eats Slimming World as well, he just has more oven bacon fat as such. Yeah, no. So yeah, this is my tea. Um, I've got an egg in fry light, I've got three pieces of bacon, um, and two homemade burgers from the 5% uh, fat mince, which is sin free, which is a protein. I've got one cheese slice on this burger, which is uh, two and a half sins. There's some onions extra on top. There's loads of onions and mushrooms inside the burger when they're cooked as well. So um, Slimming World chips, which is a free food. And this is done in that little chopper that um, I showed you before in one of my previous videos. It's um, got apple, cucumber and onion and a half a tablespoon of the Aldi lighter than light mayonnaise, which is half a thin. So that's all speed food in there. The onions are speed as well and inside the burger's got speed and then free and protein. So I'm looking forward to talking into this. I know it's a big meal, but I'm hungry and I need it. So it's better to stay on plan and eat what you're allowed. <laughs> um, I'm on my third H2O on the go. And for some more sins afterwards, I'm going to have an Alpen Lloyd's Cherry Bakewell for three sins. An Aldi Sweet, uh, a blackcurrant one for half a sin. If you're interested, it's these ones, the licorice blackcurrant ones from Aldi, I think I said that. And then a packet of the Weight Watchers Sweet and Salty Popcorn for two and a half sins. So that will take me to 11 and a half sins throughout the day today. So yeah, thanks for watching everyone and I will see you all in my next one.